motherfucker, man. There's a whole bunch of some of my bitches on this goddamn show. We should raise some money around this motherfucker. Jag, here's my goddamn ass. Man, I, I've been in Boston for a month and a half. I'm so sick of this goddamn run. I ain't gonna bullshit you. I ain't gonna play like I like the motherfucker. I don't, I'm tired of this motherfucker. I've been crying all goddamn day. It's so goddamn spark up in this home. I'm a bitch. Every time I come to this motherfucker, I'm stuck at the goddamn airport. What type of shit is this? Some of my bitches. I'm too old for this shit, man. Man, got a day of givens. Some more. Monique. Steve Harvey. Man, I'm sleepy than a motherfucker. I'm joked the fuck out. They just said everything I was gonna fucking say. I gotta think of some shit up here tonight. Monique took all my goddamn dick jokes. Dirty motherfucker, dirty motherfucker. This is a bad game. Here's a bad game. So I'm tired of bullshit. I'm sick of the fucking lying, man. You know, kings are calm, the kings are calm. Mother be counting your money. Y'all rolling. So motherfucking what, some bitch? Y'all killing. See, mother be counting your goddamn money. My family getting on my goddamn nerve, man. Crazy son of a bitch. See, motherfucking black folks, we like sympathy. Don't say nothing. Fuck, I ain't gonna say nothing. Motherfucker crazy son of a bitch, crazy. My sister crazy as a motherfucker. Walking around pregnant clothes ain't pregnant. Something wrong. Take those goddamn clothes off. You lost a baby two years ago. Take those goddamn clothes off. If I take it to a psychiatrist. Crazy bitch! Auntie, then don't say nothing. Say what's wrong, black folks. Don't say nothing. Fuck that! You need therapy. Black folks don't go to no therapy. I ain't gonna tell my problem to a motherfucker. You ought to try it. You smoke a reefer. You need to talk to somebody, then your goddamn self. Something wrong with you, son, bitch. My little nephew, man, motherfucker ain't talked in six goddamn years. They talking about ain't nothing wrong when he looking like this. When a motherfucker look like that, he got a problem. Mama, don't call him ugly. What you want me to call him? Get straight to the meat, you ugly motherfucker. Anytime mother come... I started to shoot that motherfucker the first time I came over. My wife said, where you going? I said, you see what's in the living room? You see what's in the living room? Something wrong with that motherfucker. See, tell the truth. But you old. Man, pissing is hard for him. You know you old. Stop telling the truth. Body change. You ever take a piss? You know you got to hold the wall and take a piss now. And then you grunt. Ah! Your organs getting old. They're rough. They're getting ready to pop. You know, it's like taking a shit. Then four hours later, your ass still be itching. And you go wipe your ass, you got just as much shit that you just had before. Oh, you get no. Anytime you break wind, I used to break, I used to be a father. I was a professional father. I cut a father, man, be talking, just break one off. Rawr. Sit down, man, just let it just come to the chair. <laughs> now I don't come out like that, I got a cop. And it hurt. <laughs> That's when you're wrong. When you're wrong when your woman walk around in, in a nice negligee, you don't want to be fucking bothered. Yo, put a robe on. Why don't you come over here? For what? I ain't got nothing to talk about, bitch. I ain't got nothing to talk about. Moses changed some goddamn time. And black folks church. Church make me sick. No, I'm sick of, man, let me tell you something. I'll tell you like this. I'll say what you're scared to say. I keep telling you. Church like liquor stores on every motherfucking corner. Black folks always talking about pray for them. I'm not praying for a motherfucking thing. Now you're going to throw your evil spirits on me. You know what I'm saying? You fuck up, want me to get it off you. I'm not praying for shit. You suck dick on Monday, you party on Friday, you pray on Sunday. You's a hypocrite like a summer, my bitch. 
homosexuals too. I got a problem with that. Motherfucker, ain't nothing but sisters in the choir. All fucking day. You go to black church, ain't nothing but sisters all in the choir. Make up your goddamn mind. You want to suck a dick or you want to pray? Make up your motherfucking mind. And then when you suck a dick, suck it, you know what I See, this is what I'm talking about. Hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. I got homosex with my family, you know, but I ain't got no problem with that. I still love them. But quit, they got like a bitch. You can, you can like a dick, you don't got to be like no fucker. You ain't no woman. Quit walking like a woman, quit talking like a goddamn woman. Suck a dick like a man. Grab the dick. Look at it. Ah, you know. Don't be all this kind of shit. Oh, my wife called the homosexual. He stay with me. He stay with me. He ain't no trouble. He don't never come downstairs. He don't ring. He don't answer the door. One time he answered the door, he, hold, he heard the bell ring. I guess the sound of ding dong just did something to this motherfucker. <laughs> you know, he don't do shit around the kids. That's okay. But he a man. But I asked him, I said, man, I said, what possess you, man, that like a little booty, little, you know, a little booty hole? <laughs> so I, I got asked. I tell like it is. You know what I mean? Why the fuck do you like booty hole? Because I can't understand it. Now, you know, it's not that I don't like it, it's just that, um... It's something just took over. What the fuck took over you? What the fuck urged you to like it? That's like Isaac Hayes and Barry White laying in the goddamn sauna. And I just talking about show like to lick your ass. And Barry White be like, show you right. Certain things you just don't play with, man. Kids, you don't play with kids. You don't play with the Lord and all that kind of stuff, you know. See, black folks, I love my people. I've been black a long time, you know. But the Million Man March, I ain't going no goddamn Million Man March. Fuck that. Ain't nothing gonna change. You ain't gonna march me the fucking death. You crazy, the motherfucker. <laughs> Only motherfucker plays I'm march. I'm suggesting them. I'm sick of that. Jesse Jackson, Reverend Al Sharpton. Now they say Reverend. They say Reverend Al Sharpton and Reverend Jesse Jackson. But I'll never hear him saying nothing about the Lord. I got a problem with that. But Jesse said, I don't give a fuck what Jesse said. I ain't showing up. I ain't helping nobody do shit. Y'all can talk about me all you want. I don't give a fuck. I've been marching for 43 years. Shit, still the goddamn thing. I still got the same sign I had in '67. Help, please help. Something you got to help your motherfuckers help. I tell my brother, my brother, my brother, like I tell you, he crazy. You know, he been crazy a long time. See, old folks back in the day, back in our day, you know, we, you know, we spiritual people. We pray all the time. I knew something was wrong with my brother because he hollered all the motherfucking time. Anytime some bitch holler, ain't nothing wrong with him. Something wrong with him. Ah! What, what the fuck he hollering for? At the breakfast table. Ah! My wife holler. Don't worry about it. I, something wrong. With you, motherfucker keep hollering. Ah! I think he holler one more motherfucking time. Take this hammer and knock the fuck out of his ass. And my mama always let him sleep, sleep with me because I always told him like it is. Let him sleep with you. But he can't start that goddamn hollering, mama. That motherfucker get up three, four o'clock in the house just be roaming and shit. When he got up, I'll be right behind that motherfucker. Too. I'm talking about he ain't gonna hurt nothing. You ain't sleeping with this bitch. I don't know what the fuck this retarded son of a bitch gonna do. And now they always change stuff. He's not retarded no more. He's mentally challenged. He's retarded. Sick fucker. Quit playing with the motherfucker. He's mentally challenged. He's mentally sick. My auntie had a nervous breakdown. Anytime motherfucker you just sit there and stare at the motherfucking light. I said, auntie, what's she what's she, what's she, what's she staring at? No, no, don't worry about it. Don't fucking worry about it. You see something wrong with that bitch? Look at that bitch. That was the first time I ever cursed. I was like seven, eight years old. I said, look at that bitch, mama. What's something wrong with that motherfucker? 
And all black folks crazy motherfucker they kept in the back. They always kept that motherfucker way in the goddamn back. The uncle was staying in the back. Wouldn't let the motherfucker come out. When you get mail, go to the store, and everything, you slide shit out in the fucking door. <laughs> black folks got rules. We got rules like a motherfucker, just like cards. White people play poker, bridge. We play big whist, spades. And we'll tear that motherfucking house up. We'll tear that place up. Your table be fucked up, chipped all on the fucking time. <laughs> get on it, motherfucker. Get on it, motherfucker. Renig, you pull your pistol on the motherfucker, Renig. I'm telling you. My cousin said, man, we're having a card party, Bernie. Come on, man. I said, man, I don't know, man. He said, please come, Bernie. I'm telling everybody you're coming. I said, okay, man. So I came. Boston, I swear for Lord. When I got there, police were there. Fire department was on the side. SWAT was in the goddamn trees. They had my cousin handcuffed in the back seat. I told the police officer, wait a minute, sir. I said, that's my cousin. I said, let me talk to him. He said, you better talk to him. I said, cuz, what's going on? He said, man, fuck that bitch, man. That motherfucker bitch kept, man, fucking around, man. I said, what'd she do? Every time I turned around, she was draw for him, motherfucker, draw for him. These motherfuckers playing Uno. <laughs> she ain't do nobody else like that. that drop off, drop off, drop off. I kill that bitch. <laughs> now you ever play Uno? Uno will make you kick a motherfucker ass now. Boy, I played Uno the other day, man. We remember we sitting up there playing the seven cards. All right, seven, five, four, three, two. Okay, no problem. All right, red, red, skip, skip, skip. Reverse, reverse, go, 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 go. Draw two, ain't no problem, right on, right on. Skip again, skip again, yellow, yellow, yeah, yeah, yellow, yellow. Draw four, reverse, draw four. You got one more motherfucking time, man, I'm telling you. Oh, black folk, we serious. Everything we do is serious. And we'll argue about any motherfucking thing. When we argue about anything, I ain't never, man, I ain't never used to smoke reef. I never really smoked no reef. Drugs was never my thing, because I'm already fucked up. <laughs> but for some reason, when you smoke reef, reef will make you feel like you intelligent, make you feel like you talking about some shit. <laughs> and the shit don't be nowhere near intelligent like a son bitch. You take a pull, then you, when you get older, and you reflect back on what the fuck you done said, you be saying some sick ass shit. <laughs> you mix a little turpentine with a little motherfucking Pepsi, man. The motherfucker tastes just like ginger ale. <laughs> and the motherfucker smoking what you think about it. I was black folk, we got black folk, you know, black folk, we gotta get we gotta get stronger though, you know. We do. We gotta be tighter. We gotta quit asking people to give us some, keep looking for shit, keep asking motherfuckers to march for us. We gotta take care of our fucking home. I'm telling you like it is, because I had a dream. I had a dream, man, that I was in a, uh, I, I, I passed, and I went to heaven, you know, and I was with a Mexican guy and a white guy. And I said, man, I wanna go to heaven. He said, God, right down the road. I said, well, how far? I said, just a half a mile. He said, but your name ain't on the list, Bernie. You know your name ain't on the goddamn list. <laughs> I said, well, wait a minute, man. I said, I'm going to try. He said, well, you got one more chance to make it. If you can go down there and you ask the Lord a question and he can't answer it, you might get into heaven. Well, me, the white guy, the Puerto Rican, we walked our ass on down there. Sure enough, God was on the gate reading the National Enquirer. The white guy said, I'm going to go first. You know, he always got to go first. I'm going to go first. <laughs> he went over to the Lord. He whispered in the Lord's ear. He said, who discovered America? And the Lord laughed. Christopher Columbus. He said, go, I'm sorry, go on on down the hill. The Puerto Rican said, I got it, I got it. <laughs> he said, I got it, I got it. He said, I got it, I got it. He said, who sang? How many was in the Beatles? 
I said, go get the heck on out of here, man. Oh, man, go on, go on, go. I said, okay. So he looked at me. I looked at him. He looked at me. I looked at him. And I whispered, and I whispered something to the Lord. And he looked at me. And he looked up. He looked down. He said, mm. Open the gate. I walked on in. The white guy said, that's bullshit, man. How the fuck did he get in there? That's bullshit. He said, hey, father, what did the black guy ask you? He asked me, when was black people ever going to stick together?